Hello everyone, I'm Susanna St. Germain, Architect Evangelist here at Salesforce. And today I'm gonna to show you how you can get started with Salesforce data models. So let's get into it. Salesforce data models used to look like this. Static images, that's it. But today, Salesforce data models are dynamic. You can view them on the web, you can download them, and you can also customize and extend them with a tool like Lucidchart. So let's head on over to the Architect Digital Home, architect.salesforce.com, to get started. From here, I'm going to click on Design, then Reference Architecture Gallery. And here you'll see the newest data models that we've published. If you don't see the data model you're looking for, let us know in the comments. Teams across Salesforce add new data models every month. Let's click into the Sales Cloud data model. From here, I can download this data model as a PDF, which is a great way to get an accessible version of a data model so that folks using screen readers can access them. Or you can open this data model as a template in Lucidchart. Let's open up this template in Lucidchart. From here, I can view my data model, and since it's a Lucidchart template, I can also customize and extend it using shapes from the Salesforce Diagrams kit of parts. One thing to note is that Lucidchart templates are a paid feature, so with a free Lucidchart account, the data model would be view only. And that's it. I hope to see you back here very soon on the Salesforce Architects YouTube channel. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this content helpful and ring that bell so you'll get an alert anytime we post a new video. See you soon.